This is a Brooklyn bound. Hey again, we're back at Gotham City Billiards, the best of billiards in Brooklyn. Today we meet amateur player and coach Kevin Chong. He tells us why pool and teaching mean so much to him and how he's able to hold on to a piece of his family's legacy. So here's his story on Gotham City Grind. My name is Kevin Chung. I'm 27. I was born in Brooklyn. So my father is from Malaysia. He's Hakka. And my mother was born in New York. She's Toy San. I was first introduced to the game of pool at the age of 12 through my cousin Steven. My cousin was 17 years older than me. It was one bright sunny day and he really just wanted me to do an activity. So what he did was he brought me to a pool hall that was nearby the house. It was the first time I was taking on a new sport. At that time I was really just studying and playing a lot of video games. And he just wanted me to go out and explore. What really got me into the game was the first time I actually held a pool stick and took my first shot. It was probably the greatest time of my life, but also the most embarrassing time of my life. I was hanging out with my cousin and his friends at a pool hall and I just had no idea what I was doing. And the moment I took that first shot and made it in, it was probably the happiest moment at that time. I was actually playing some trick shots, and I had no idea at the time what they were, but I was just playing them and executing it very well. And it was so amazing to see my cousin and his friends giving me applause, and just giving me that confidence, you know, in life, and playing pool. Through pool, that actually helped me relieve a lot of the stress I was feeling from schoolwork to getting approval from my parents. Just learning how to discipline yourself, that was probably the one key factor that helped me at that time. Don't be nervous. Build that confidence and use that confidence. Through my cousin, he showed me a lot of things about discipline at the time, which really helped with my stress and showed me that through pool, you can actually find yourself in a better sense without having to think about so many other issues and just have that focus on what you need to do next. My cousin was one of the toughest guys that I knew. Fortunately though, he was dealing with cancer at the time and he, couldn't, he just couldn't overcome it. I didn't just lose a cousin, I lost one of my best friends. My mom was very supportive of me when it came to playing pool. Um, to be honest, it was probably embarrassing, but at the same time, the most encouraging. She actually came to one of my first tournaments and at that tournament I actually took second place and that was also in honor of my cousin who just passed away at the time and that that was just an amazing moment for me for the fact that I didn't have a lot of things going for me but through feeling that support that was a really big moment that really gave me that I really felt like my cousin was looking out for me for that whole tournament because there were moments where I sort of gave up but thinking of those great moments that I had hanging out with my cousin playing pool with his friends it just pushed me that much harder and just lifting that trophy for the first time it meant the most for the fact that I felt that I felt my cousin was next to me while I was lifting up that trophy. <sighs> really got to test myself in terms of discipline. I got a lot of support through Gotham. Ever since coming back to the pool scene, I'm grateful for coming to Gotham because they didn't just provide me with the right resources, but a great place to play. After watching the exhibition with Coca and George, it really showed me that if you put in the time and the practice, that anything is possible. <laughs> My cousin taught me that practice makes perfect, but it's important to have a little perspective to not take the game or life too seriously. Here, Kevin looks serious, but he's just super disciplined and focused. What's the most important part for me is to keep my cousin's legacy alive and just sharing my passion in pool and sharing that with others to show them what my cousin left for me. When working with someone new to pool, the moment that sticks out the most would be watching them take their first shot. He loves to coach and teach others. 
It makes him feel good to share the sport. It also makes him feel a little nostalgic. For him, his cousin is always on his mind when he plays pool. Because in that first shot, I'm always reminded of my cousin. With the same excitement and passion that I felt, I feel that I'm sharing the same. That was one of the students, actually, one of the guys. Pretty cool. Yeah, it's good to see them actually come back. Legacy comes from how we make others feel and what we gave to them. It is our job to give back while we're here. If we want to be remembered, we must give everything that we've got. Whether it's your knowledge, courage, strength, happiness, love, compassion, give it all away. Because when we're gone, and only our loved ones are here to remember us, we want to leave a legacy that we're proud of.